Is that Percival? What do all these clues mean? Welcome back to Strong Arm Flicks. I'm your boy T Flame, and Zack Snyder dropped a picture of, I believe it's Percival, on his Vero account, and it's got the letters 214. 214. Um, I've been trying to make sense of this and figure out what it is, and um, I seen uh, a video by my boy uh, Subjective Reviews. Shout out to him, and uh, he said that um, uh, 214 happens to be uh, Valentine's Day and also um, the story of Percival is a story about uh, being distracted by love if you strip it down to its core I mean it's about the devil disguised as a beautiful woman yes but if you break it down to its core to its essence it's a story about being distracted by love and what what better reference to Valentine's Day is there than that not to mention 214 is actually Valentine's Day. So I think that uh, this is hinting at something coming Valentine's Day, guys. So be on the lookout for that. Now also, there's an image that Zach posted a while back of Superman um, being held. And it's, it's symbolic in the nature of it. It, it represents uh, Jesus Christ. And it says on there, he has yet to rise. This was posted a little while back. And I was like, okay, well, that's neat. But then recently, real recently, like the other day, Zach posted this image right here on Vero. And this one says, the ship can feel his presence. And it's a never before scene of the fucking Flash uh, uh, in the Kryptonian ship with Superman's casket sitting there with his hands on it. And the ship can tell that it can feel his presence, like it says and the little things are opening up and it's shooting out the Superman suits and shit like it did in Man of Steel when he would walk by and it showed the different shit and this scene must be real close to the deleted scene that we got on the Justice League Blu-ray DVD where it showed uh, Superman walking through the ship and as he's walking one of the things open up and the fucking black suit's there and he looks at it but then he walks up to the red and blue suit and then that's the end of the, that's the, end of the clip I believe that that is extremely close to this scene right here. I'm not exactly sure, but uh, what what is what does all this mean? I mean, all this shit that he's dropping is uh, they're bits and pieces to a larger puzzle. Zach has always been cryptic like this, but what does it really mean? If you break it all down, what is he trying to tell us? Well, from what I can tell, it's about birth, death, and then rebirth. Zack Snyder has always been symbolic in the nature of comparing Superman as a Jesus Christ-like figure. And what day is Jesus' birthday? Christmas. Okay. So, the picture of him saying, he's yet to rise. And it shows him, and his arms are out like Christ, like when he was crucified. And then this image about, the ship can feel his presence. What I think this is all hinting at, guys, I think that what he's trying to tell us is that Christmas Day, we are going to get an official announcement. This is, now don't get your hopes up too crazy. This is my theory. I think that what he's trying to say is that Christmas Day, we're going to get a fucking announcement about the Snyder Cut, an official announcement from Warner Brothers, and I believe that an official trailer or the movie itself will be coming out on Valentine's Day. So Christmas coming up, we'll get an announcement, uh, Superman will be reborn, and we will get a official response from Warner Brothers and then I believe that Valentine's Day we will get our official trailer what do you guys think about that let me know in the comment section below that's the video thanks for tuning in if you like what you see like what you hear please smash that subscribe button and ring that bell till next time